me tell you guys about my story when I got bullied. So, what do I think about bullies? There, there's really no reason. But first, better like and subscribe because you, not a lot of you guys are doing this. And that's what's making me mad. So, please do that and make sure to hit the notification bell. But, let's get started with the video anyways. So, bullies. What do I think about them? They shouldn't, there's really no reason to bully at all. Because they just feel like making fun of people because of how they look. But they shouldn't. Because when this happens, you get bullied. Or maybe because you bully because you want to pretend that that's the bully. And then you take your anger off somebody else. But that's not the right thing. Because if you do that, then the bully will bully you more. But that doesn't mean that they should do it. Because, like, punching somebody is wrong. Slapping somebody is wrong. Even putting up the middle finger or just, say, cursing is wrong. Not all this stuff is bad for some schools. But most schools say it's bad because it mostly is. However, I think it's terrible. But when I was in first grade, I got bullied by this kid. But I'll tell you his name later. So, when I was in first grade, I went to this school called Penwood. And it was a pretty small school. Not even going to lie. Probably like 500 people went there. But when I went to this school, I had a teacher named Mrs. Lanfear. I think that's her name. Wait, hold up. Yeah, Mrs. Lanfear. Definitely. That, I'm pretty sure that was her name, and I think that's how you spell it. But sometimes, some of my classmates would say lamp ear instead of lamp ear. So, yeah. So, please don't be embarrassed because I should probably say that sometimes. So, when I was in first grade, I got bullied by a kid. His name was Nate. Now, this kid, wait. You know what? We'll, we'll just call him Nate. I don't know. Maybe, maybe not. And so, when I was in first grade, I got bullied because he thought that I was stupid. But uh, my grades, my grades, they were about, like, B and C's. Not really A's, but at least B and C's. So, at least, let's talk about upstanders and a bystander. Who are these two? Well, upstanders are better than bystanders. So, let me tell you about an upstander. And an upstander is somebody who stands up for the victim and does not bully the bull. Just tells him to stop or tries to make him stop. But if he doesn't, then he tries to bully. Just kidding. Do not do that. But if you're a bystander, then that means you're somebody who really wants to stand up for the bully. But don't be like that. Just be a normal person. Well, everybody's normal. But everybody's weird. We do weird things. Like, we poop. We poop. But honestly, Penwood, I used to go to Penwood. This was in first grade. So when I was walking down the hot damn hallway, I saw him. Yes, a kid with a cap. Backwards. Just like his brain. He was looking straight dead eye at me. And he was smiling. Jesus, like, jeez, he was like this. But honestly, I was making a humongous frown. Then, I just ran. He was he was trying to run at me, and guess what he did? He did. He definitely did. But, he catched up with me, and then we saw the hall monitor. When I saw the hall monitor, he told us to stop. But first, he told me what happened. So I told him what happened, and guess what happened? He started to look at the boy like... He did something wrong. It's like, what did you do? So, ah, guess what? He, guess what? The kid's name was Bryson, and he did this. He punched him in the damn face. Knocked him off. Bam, on the floor. His cap was on the chest. But then, the next day after the school day of that, I told Mrs. Lanfear what happened. And... She decides to walk out the door. Now I knew where she was going because it had, my door had because my class door had a window. So I put my backpack besides the desk and I decide just to wait 
So, while I was waiting, Mrs. Lanfear went down the hallway and was asking Nate. I think she was having a little conversation with Nate because Nate was getting up in all my bays and trying to bully. So, she was like, did you bully somebody? He got to get, get home. He got suspended for lying. So, if you do that, don't do it. Okay? So, please don't do that. Please don't lie. But, when I was in school, I used to lie. But, we're not talking about that. So, wait, I'm still am in school. It doesn't really matter. But when I saw her walking back, she come in, and I told her, so what happened? She told me what happened. So, the next school day, I didn't get bullied. You know why? Well, because I told the teacher what happened. Well, no, I told Bryson what happened. Then I told the teacher. You shouldn't tell people that you, that there's a bully. Why? Because that will, because that bully will bully more people, and that, and it will be more bad because they'll, they'll come like a hundred times harder at you. I don't know why people think that bullies just think that like, well, not bullies. Well, mostly kids. Kids just think that when you tell on them. They're going to come like a hundred times harder at you. So, guess what? That doesn't really happen. i never seen that happen. So, please. Ah. Please sub, like, and hit the notification bell for more videos. Because I am making so many videos. I didn't make a remake of this video because I spelled so wrong. I never got to make a cap capital. So, yeah, please. And, by the way, have fun. But, wait. Do not bully. Because bullying ain't the right thing. And make sure to sub. Make sure to sub. So please do this. Or else you will not be watching my videos. Now bye. Have a good day.